Before the opening bell, U.S. indices closing higher on Wednesday, led by shares in energy, consumer services, and food and staples retailing sectors. On the economic docket, MBA mortgage applications falling by 3.7 percent year over year in the week ended February 8th, from a decline of 2.5 percent the previous week. In other news, CPI remaining unchanged month over month in January, and the monthly deficit improving to $13.5 billion in December. This all while advancers ahead of decliners, 67 percent of S&P 500 constituents trading higher yesterday. Now, after after the markets closed, Cisco Systems announcing second quarter adjusted EPS up 16% year over year to 73 cents on revenue up 7% year over year to $12.45 billion. Asian markets mixed today, the Nikkei down 0.02%, the Hang Seng down 0.23%, China's ESI 300 up 0.15% and South Korea's Kospi up 1.11%. European markets gaining ground in U.S. futures calling for a positive start. Now in terms of expectations today, Coca-Cola, Nvidia, CBS, CME Group all expected to release their earnings this session. Well, on the economic dock at 8.30 in the morning, we have both the January PPI final demand read and initial and continuing jobless claims figures, as well as December retail sales, advanced numbers, and November business inventories. Over in the markets, the S&P 500 is where we begin. That sees the upside prevail, while the Nasdaq sees further upside, but that's also in focus. The relative strength index advocates for further upside. Long positions above 7,003 are favored with targets at 70.70 and 71.20 extension while the Dow Jones sees the upside prevail.